guess what guys it's Aminicon day this is my son my big son favorite porridge and it's also my favorite porridge so today guys i'm going to show you how to make the best Aminicon porridge we grow up on this <laughs> guys so this is corn i've been soaking it in some water you can see i wash it then i put it in the water and i soak it so what i'm going to do now guys i'm going to pressure it pressure it because the corn is hard so you need to pressure that corn to become soft and then i'm going to grate some coconut i'm going to put some carnation milk some sweet condensed milk some cinnamon some nutmeg some vanilla yes guys we're going to make Jamaica Amini corn porridge. So as you can see, I already put the corn inside the pressure pot. So I'm just adding some more water over it to cover the corn. And I'm going to close it guys and pressure it for 30 minutes. Yes, guys. Guys, as you can see, my pressure cooker is over there pressuring with the Aminicon and I did greater in the coconut. It's so hard to resist this coconut. Trust me, they're tasting real good. That is the reason why guys, I always love to grate my coconut because I can get a chance to eat it at the same time when I grate in it. And I find your fresh coconut give your food a different taste, a fresh taste, a nice taste. Yes, that is the reason why I like it. <laughs> coconut all over my mouth. <laughs> okay, so I'm just grating the coconut and then I'm going to pour about two cups of water inside it to get the juice. And then I'm going to strain it and I'm going to whisk it in the flour and I'm going to add it to my almond corn when it's finished to boil to thicken up. So guys here you see my mom just cleaned up the grater. Whatever you call it in your country, it's all it's the same. It's greater. What? It's greater. I never know. So I'm just going to waste the coconut milk like that to get out all the, the juice together. And the plumps, you're gonna strain it up. Yeah, it's not plumps kissy, the coconut. Um, so I'm making mistakes with words now. Mm -hmm. I'm going to use my hand, clean hand, and I'm going to squeeze out all that goodness, all that juice, all that coconut juice to go inside my delicious porridge. So as you can see guys, wow, you see that smoke? See what? My corn is finished. Wow, it looks so soft and good. Yes, this is the way how I want it. Yes, you see it's finished, it's soft, it's nice, it's tender. <laughs> yeah! You get so excited. excited. I know what you're so, going to say. So what I'm going to do guys, I'm going to pour half of the coconut milk inside it. Turn on back the heat. Leave it come to a boil and then I'm going to add the flour in the next half of the coconut milk to this now guys i'm going to add my cinnamon this is a good time to add the cinnamon because i want to smell that flavor if you have cinnamon stick you can add the cinnamon stick inside it it already smell like the porridge yeah Um, rice porridge. 
just that the rice is very yellow. <laughs> okay, I'm going to leave it come to a boil and I will get back to you guys. Okay guys, so I'm just going to take about one, two, three tablespoon of flour. All purpose flour guys. And I'm going to add the rest of the coconut milk in it. And I'm going to whisk it in. So no lumps in it when I pour it inside the porridge. to a boil I will add it to it so it has come to a boil so now I'm going to gently add my flour mixture and coconut milk to it and I'm going to leave this boil on low heat for at least 20 minutes guys don't take your eyes off it because the flour does stick in fast and you don't want it to become hard as a rock you want it to be like a porridge so don't take your eyes every three four minutes you come you store you come you store okay guys so now what i'm going to do i'm going to add some carnation milk about half of this carnation milk so it's three milk inside it you have the coconut milk you have the carnation milk and then after 15 minutes i'm going to add the sweet condensed milk to it so i'm going step by step right now i'm going to add a little more cinnamon inside it i'm going to grate her some fresh nutmeg Nutmeg is always better when it's fresh. Trust me, guys. Nutmeg. Nutmeg. I love the fragrance of nutmeg. I love to smell it. it's already 15 minutes so now I'm going to add my vanilla to my porridge and I'm going to add my sweet condensed milk to it about half of this guys you know this is so thick so it's hard to come out so about half of the condensed milk in it you just fold it in so I'm going to put a pinch of salt guys you did not see but when I was doing the the corn pressure in it I put a teaspoon of salt in it so now I'm just going to add a pinch more to it and what mommy says about salt keeps it clean but when I use it I'm guys my amini corn porridge otherwise known as porridge is finished as corn porridge is finished so now i'm going to pour myself a bowl guys <laughs> delicious mm -mm. what about me and <laughs> you will pour yourself i can't wait to eat this what You smell that kissy? Mm. Oh my god. Mm. I'm going to add some more nutmegs 
guys as you can see i didn't add sugar to mine because you know i don't like sugar i was looking for coconut sugar today in the shop but i couldn't find any so i'm just going to drink it that way but if you want you can add honey to it or brown sugar or white sugar. Remember to share, to tell a friend, to like, to hit that notification bell, and remember, God is love. <laughs> 